In this Blender tutorial I will show you how to convert a solid object into a tubular or wire cage. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. OK. The, the system I'm going to use here could be used uh, to convert this cube if you wanted to or any other object within reason. Um, although you will, if you wanted to make a uh, more than a sort of a square um, tubular frame if you like you would have to subdivide this uh, square up but for now I'm actually gonna just um, press X on my keyboard and then left click on delete to remove the cube and if you hold down shift followed by A next to mesh I don't know left click on something like UV sphere press 1 followed by 5 on your numbers pad to go into front orthographic view and then if you roll your middle mouse you can zoom in a bit OK, press tab on your keyboard and this will take you into edit mode now if you press X on your keyboard again um, this brings up your delete options and what you want to do is left click on only faces and this will give you a wire frame now if you press A this will reselect everything. To the left of the screen, look for the button that says subdivide. Now, depending on the object you're converting, will really largely depend on how many subdivisions you need to put in. I'm going to put in, um, I think, four. So I'm just going to left click, left click on subdivide four times. And that should be enough and then press tab on your keyboard to go back into object mode then you hold down alt followed by C left click on curve from mesh text this will convert this into a curve for want of a better word um, OK now hold down shift followed by A and then next to curve left click on circle this is the second item down click on circle and press R followed by X then 9 0 to rotate it 90 degrees on the X axis left click to accept press G to grab the circle and take it over to the left of the sphere and then press S and move your mouse to reduce it in size a bit don't go too mad because you don't want to lose it and left click. Right click on your sphere and then to the right of the screen between the wrench and the orange disc you'll actually see a curve with a couple of highlighted dots on it. This is your curve data button. Left click on this. Then in the geometry box underneath bevel object left click in the box then left click Bezier circle and this will happen. Now if you want to reduce the size of these sort of wires, uh, my phone's just gone off, but we will ignore that. Um, right click on the circle, and then if you press S again, you can gradually reduce the size of your cage. And when you're happy with the size, yeah, I'll do. Right click on the sphere again, hold down Alt C. And then left click mesh from curve meta surf text. Once you've done that, you can then smooth your sphere off if you want by left clicking on smooth to the left of the screen. And that is basically a very simple wire sort of or tubular cage. Hopefully, that's helped somebody. Thank you for watching. Cheers.